Chris Cox here. Today we're going to take a look at the hip quadrant test. The hip quadrant test is used to assess for any hip pathology in the actual joint. You're going to have your patient in supine and you're going to place their hip at about 70 degrees of hip flexion and you're going to provide an axial compression force through the femur. Start the test by having the hip in a little bit of adduction and while performing that adduction and compression force, you're going to take their hip into about 120, 130 degrees of hip flexion and go back and forth like that. And then you repeat with the hip in a slight horizontal abduction, abduction. Now I will repeat this on the right side so you can see how it's looking from there, but you wanna be on the same side as your test. So uh, longitudinal compression through the femur with adduction and going through the arc of motion 70 degrees to about 130 of hip flexion. And then repeat an AB duction. A positive test would be pain reproduction along the anterior or lateral hip and with some possible quicking as well.